Thanks for tuning in to Fly King Drone. Appreciate it if you'd click to subscribe to support the channel. I've been continuing my exposure tests with the MJX Bugs 16 Pro, and I'm getting some better results. I uh, did a couple of things here in this particular video. I just wanted to get it up quick to, to show people the improvements and show that the camera can do a pretty good job. I took it downward a little bit more to get uh, more uh, focused on the, the ground and, and less on the sky. And you'll notice that the, the lake, the clarity of the boats definitely turned out better. The sky, on the other hand, looks significantly worse. <laughs> but I guess you have to kind of balance those exposures. I've done some very consistent tests, and unfortunately, for some reason, the video uh, timestamps jump back to 2019. And when you're recording on the Bug 16 Pro, you don't get to set how it uh, timestamps or marks the files. For whatever reason, it decided I was recording in 2019, so I put all of my videos in a different order, and of course then they didn't match up to what my exposure uh, noted. I believe this particular one is with a uh, brightness of about 50, a saturation of about 64, and ISO 100, white balance on daylight. I'll uh, continue to do my testing. I'll get some more consistent recordings uh, with more details on the exact settings I had in the drone to give you a better idea of uh, how the video is turning out. But again, this one, pure adjustments within the camera itself, no changes in post-production. So I did not do any sharpening. I did not do any uh, it is literally raw footage straight out of the drone that you would then take into DaVinci or into uh, Adobe Premiere and make your edits. So let me know what you think. I'll continue with my experiments and hopefully the timestamps will stay consistent so that I can uh, match it up to my detailed notes on exposures to give you an idea of uh, what settings you might experiment with and what you'll start with with your drone. Have a great day and thanks for watching.